in this short video I'm going to show you how to replace the overdrive control switch on your Mitsubishi Delica switch comes with a gear column shifter handle this is a used but known good working this one doesn't work well it shifts the gears but overdrive doesn't stay on since you push the switch it goes up to the off position and uh, yeah not good we diagnosed it i talked about the wiring schematics how it all works video will be down in the description below also how to do the quick fix if you have to disable your overdrive video will be up there in the description check it out and today we're going to put a new one for the repair you need a long phillips screwdriver pliers hammer and we also will use the silicone based uh, compound well what to do if you don't have a replacement part you don't have the switch and a shifter handle and uh, you have a problem with the overdrive push switch well there's always a solution and ways around you can install the regular switch for example like we have a light switch like that just same switch same principle same wiring just for overdrive control function and there's an awesome video on YouTube. I watched this some time ago. There's a YouTube channel called uh, Team Miyagi, M-I-Y-A-G-I. -I. We'll put a link down in the description. Yeah, called a Delica Overdrive better than a toothpick. And uh, yeah, we don't have a toothpick. We have a chunk of wood. It's better than toothpick. But yeah, he explains everything in detail, how to wire, how to install it. Very basic, very simple. Three wires, how to identify that. And uh, we're not going to cover that. Yeah, great video. Check it out. Tilt the steering wheel all the way down. As you can see, I already have my two column steering columns covers removed. There is just a one, two, three, four, five Phillips screws. Remove them and pull those covers apart. Now we're getting to the handle. There's just the electrical connector, three wires. Just push them this clip like that. Here we go, disconnect it. Let's undo this holding, I would say, clip for the wiring harness. Move it out like that to get to the locking pin for the shifter handle. Let's pull this rubber cover up like that as you can see now we have to move this wiring up a little bit there's a plastic locking collar we have to slide it up it's pretty easy just to tap it with a hammer like that there we go here's a pin just remember which way handle was assembled it's a small hammer and just tap it up like that. As soon as it's up, you can grab it with the pliers, twist it and pull it out. Nice and easy. Now handle can slide out. There we go. Nice and cool. Yeah. Good boy. As a replacement, I have three known good working overdrive switches. Before installing the replacement part, let's just apply a little bit of silicone based grease like that. Just spread it on the end. It will help it to slide free like so. Just remove the rest. Okay, the right. grease already applied. Let's pull the pin out like that get this handle all the way to align those holes get a pin in yeah that's it make sure it's even pin is in it's even on both sides sticking out this flat slot should be aligned with the pin and uh, keep a wire up like that make sure it's not jammed underneath just 
go over and slide it down here we go wire is out it came out through the upper opening nice and easy and let's connect our electrical connector first like that all the way click in place put it here and uh, yeah bend those holding clips like that and uh, I'll leave a little bit of slack here nice and just pull this foot down and uh, yeah that's it put those covers back and uh, good to go before putting a steering column plastic covers back let's check the operation of the switch turn the key to the on position and uh, it's solid it's firm good one solid click locked and uh, my light is off pushing off on off on yeah simple as that you know my overdrive is working again how it should beautiful if it's helpful thumbs up thank you so much guys for your time watching this video and if you have any comments critics suggestions concerns questions put everything down in the comment section below under the video and uh, yeah see you soon keep your old reliable delica on the road in this vehicle won't ever let you down see you